uh, home wins are, are huge. Uh, now we just got to focus on going one game at a time on the road and uh, starting in two days. That's three home games and six points for the National Predators. Victorious Saturday night against the New Jersey Devils. 2-1 in a shootout. Not every game was easy, but they got the six points, and that's what matters for the standings. Justin Bradford, Penalty Box Radio with the Ingram Agency Post Game Report. Let's get the National Predators victorious against the New Jersey Devils. 2-1 in the shootout. Ryan Johansson with a beautiful shootout move to seal the victory there. But Yusuf Saros came up big when he had to as well. It was a great game. Here's Austin Watson. Yeah, it's huge. Um, obviously, we didn't like the, the way the road trip went for us. Um, came back here and, and really did what we needed to do um, to get all six of the points was huge for us. And, um, you know, before we go on the road here, right before Christmas break. Yeah, yeah, just try to keep my eye, eye on the puck and not, not make the first move. And, yeah, yeah, I was happy to happy to make the, make the safe step. A bit like the other game, you know, we've been working hard and we came back, but we kept our composure and obviously uh, you say did such a great job in shootouts and the whole game, so a uh, big win. While the Devils have been really struggling on the road, it's still a tight game. Here's what Austin Watson had to say about what made this game so tight, why New Jersey Devils are really tough to play against, even with their bad, bad road record. They, they play a tight game and they, they don't stop working. It can be a little bit frustrating at times. Um, you know, you think you're getting a little bit of a leeway going, but you know they're back in your face and um, you know clogging things up and not giving up too much. So um, credit to them over there. They're uh, you know well coached and they work so hard. If there's a line that's been really impressive so far in these past few games, it's that fourth line, Freddie Goudreau, Mika Salamaki, Rocco Grimaldi, really making things happen. Offensive opportunities, shutting down the opponents, and hey, Freddie Goudreau had a goal tonight. Yeah, I think it's just our ability to just go there and want, want to make a difference. Um, Rocco and Mika are so fast, and I think that that helps us just creating opportunity, creating turnovers, um, and just putting pressure in a deep down their zone. I think that's what we're trying to do. Freddie's line has been the most noticeable line on the ice. They're just they're relentless with their work ethic, um, their speed, their tenacity on the puck. Um, they seem to have some chemistry together. Scored a big goal for us tonight, and um, they were terrific. They're very, very noticeable when they're on the ice. Predators thought they scored on the power play, but New Jersey challenged for goal interference, and the goal was overturned. Bench obviously had to react to that. Here's they got back into the game. Yeah, I mean, we definitely wanted to get it back, but, you know, and the way it goes with the challenges and stuff like that, I think, um, you know, we're, we're used to it, whether it goes our way or whether it doesn't. Um, you know, you, you don't really know um, how it's going to work out, but you're prepared either way. The penalty kill has obviously gotten a lot better since Austin Watson returned to the lineup. He had three minutes, 42 seconds on the penalty kill tonight. Very aggressive. Here's what made them successful. No, I'm not sure. It's something that I definitely take pride in, but, um, you know, I think it's like when you see anybody come back to the lineup, I think Larry talks about it, that balance, um, just being able to uh, to have those groups and the pairs that, you know, me and Sis have uh, killed together for a long time. So, um, you know, being able to complement each other and, you know, have that rotation in place is, uh, has been good for us. Now, after this three-game homestand, the Predators go on the road for four games, including a back-to-back -back early next week. They have to stay focused. Christmas break coming up, but those four games taking it game by game. Well, I mean, I, I know we talk about it, about it a lot, but especially, um, you know, here with you know, some of the bodies out, it's, it's really day by day. Um, you know, we'll take that first game on and then, um, you know, we'll look to the next one. But, you know, this homestand for us was, was huge to kind of get back on track after a, a tough little road trip for us, and we're looking forward to getting on the road. There you have it, National Predators, six points in three games on the three-game homestand, victorious tonight over the New Jersey Devils, 2-1 in the shootout. This is Justin Bradford with the Penalty Box Radio, Anger Agency Post Game Report. Hallelujah. Holy shit, where's the Tylenol?